Okay, so I've just laid the saddle out with the stirrup laid out, right? And what you can see is that this stirrup right now is flat to the ground. And what we want is for the stirrup to be perpendicular to the ground so that it automatically puts the twist in. Put the twist the other way. Okay, yeah. So the first step is you remove the hobble and just set it aside, okay? And then you slide the blevin, and the thing to do is count your holes. I think we were on four, three and four? Correct. Okay, great. And so now I'm going to lay that down. I'm going to take the blevin off. I'm going to twist it, and I'm going to put it back on. Okay. Now this part, you, it's just, you have to play with it because you have to figure out which way you're going to turn. And it's different on the two sides. So I'm going to turn it so that my... Um, I'm coming in from the back side, and that's why I turned the blevin around. Oh. And now it's perpendicular to the ground. Okay? And then depending, and this is the part, depending on how much leather I have and how short it is, sometimes you need to massage this down a little bit so the buckle's not poking in your in your leg. And see, you don't have a lot of yoke here, right? You don't, your fender's rather short but I'm gonna do my best. And I smash this down and I take my hobble. And of course, having strong fingers is helpful. And so then you want to soften your leather to work that down. And now you have a permanent twist just like that. Okay? Yes, thank you. Cool.